I mean, just me competing, I mean, that's kind of the main uh, emphasis of what we're trying to do here is that we're trying to compete every single day, get as many competitive reps as we can because it's fall camp. You know, it's a great time for us to get great competition against um, not only ourselves, but against other teams. So that's just kind of the emphasis that we're working on. How important what? is this two days coming up with the Cardinals for you to try and so solidify your claim on that right tackle job? I mean, every day is important. I mean, every day, even if we have a regen day, every day is important because we're learning in the film room or we're trying to take care of our bodies or if we're on the field, we're trying to figure out ways that we can improve ourselves, compete against each other, get better with our technique and trying to compete and trying to strain and get conditioned. So there's not a single day that's more important than the next one. It's just trying to build on each day. We see you within the same game playing on the left side and the right side. How has that been for you as far as making that transition so quickly? Um, I mean, it's just whatever the team wants me to do, you know. I'm just glad that they want me to play different positions because I'll play whatever position they need me to play for me to help the team win, whatever that whatever that takes. Are there any complications that, that you run into, or is it just smooth for you? Um, you can't have complications. It's the NFL. You know what I mean? you got to compete every single day. you got to win your rep. It doesn't matter what position you're at. you got to go up against the best, so you got to win your reps, and it doesn't really. there's no real complications because you got to figure it out. How do you feel like you've grown into that position on the right side? I feel like I've grown a lot. I mean, the vets here are amazing. Um, Coach Keith is amazing as well, and Braves also comes in and helps me out. I mean, it's just growing is kind of built with getting reps. There's going to be reps where you lose. There's also going to be reps where you win, and even reps where you feel like you won, but you have a small technique change that you can make for you to improve it and make it better. So that's how I feel like I've been growing. At first year, so much thrown at you. That's one thing. But what, what, when did things maybe start to slow down with the way where you not relax, but you think about it? Um, I mean, it's the NFL. I mean, nothing's really going to be slow. I mean, it's the best league in all of sports, and it's the fastest league. You know what I mean? So, like, there's not really going to be a moment where you think everything slows down, but you just kind of grasp things. You get better at the things that you work on every single day. And you mentioned Vrabel coaching. What, what's he like as far as an encourager and, and as a teacher? He's exactly what you think he is. He's one of the best coaches I ever had, one of the best head coaches I ever had in terms of not only motivating guys, but also teaching. And he's probably one of the few coaches I've had in my time in sports in general that knows every single position. I mean, it's amazing how he can go from one position unit, talk about the technique, talk about the scheme, talk about the other team, talk about the other side, the offense or the defense, and then go to that same other room on the other side of the ball and talk about the same exact scheme, talk about the same exact technique and mindset. Everybody Nick, I talk to about you says the same thing. You're a really smart guy who likes to ask questions. Have the amount of questions cut down to where you can just play at this point? Um, you know, we have some fines in the O-line room if you ask too many questions. <laughs> like, you kind of need to just understand it. But, I mean, no, I mean, Keith is great. The vets are great. If I ever have questions, I always go to them and ask them about things. And they've been helping me so far. I mean, it's just trying to learn everything I can and trying to do the best that I can do for the team. What's important is maybe finishing camp, finishing the preseason on the high note. What's maybe most important about these next couple of weeks? Uh, I mean, like I've been saying, I just got to take it uh, day by day, you know, just getting better each and every day, just build my confidence up, just build my, my uh, skill level up, and uh, just take it one day at a time. For you guys behind there, how important is third down and being able to show that you can it's definitely important, you know, like I said, I'm trying to get better at everything, catching, blocking, whatever, whatever the team needs me to do, I'm going to do it, you know, so but third down is definitely uh, important down that we, that we need to convert on. At this point, do you feel, Brooke is always talking about how you're coming in and absorbing everything, at this point, do you feel like you've absorbed it and you can go play, or is it still kind of a learning process? Uh, I mean, I definitely feel like I uh, absorbed it uh, pretty good. You know, like I've been saying, I always feel like I can keep getting, uh, keep getting better, keep learning, uh, just, just picking, picking uh, the vets' uh, brains and uh, just see how they do things, and I uh, just keep getting better each and every day. So it's always uh, good to learn. What do you hope to show between now and you know, the end of that preseason game? Uh, just show that my show my teammates that I can you know whatever the coach need me to do I'm gonna do it no matter what it is kick off kick return whatever and uh, I'm, I'm gonna get it done uh, to the best of my ability you know just uh, just gaining the trust of my teammates and my coaches. I'm gonna make sure I do what I do the best to help the team and everything that I, I, I put forth and every day I try to come in I try to make myself more available for the team coaches and more available for myself. When you walked in last year, it was sort of like, how do I get on the field in like three days and help yeah. them win? Now that you've had more time, is it, are you able to expand your role? Is it, can you define it more clearly? What's it look like? Just trying to be do, do my best to help the team. You know, 
whatever role coaches and the players have for me, I'm going to do my best to try to go out and fulfill that role and just come out every day to try to compete and do my, uh, put my best out on the field so I can put it all on tape. How good of a pass catcher do you think you are out of the backfield, and how important is that to what you can do in this offense? Uh, me, from my, my opinion, I'm, I'm elite with it, uh, but uh, I think it will play a, a tremendous role for the offense. I definitely got a skill set that can help the team. And like I said, once before, like whatever they need me to do, I'm, I'll be willing to do it. I take it past protection is the other side of that. Mm-hmm. Derek usually is not out there on yeah. third down. Is that a very important part of your job? Yeah, you got you to be able to protect the QB in this game. You know, those guys worth a lot of money, and you got to be able to go out there and put your body and your mind on, on the line for it and, and protect them. Have to miss the time. Yeah, man, it's very frustrating that I got that I missed a game, you know. Uh, so <laughs> I was kind of e- eager to get back out here. Uh, I was just showing that, you know, I can I, I can, I can be, be a play, uh, play call in the back, you know, because uh, we got a very complex de- defense, you know. So uh, so I'm so and then where the, where the signal call is back there. So I just I just got to run, run the defense and run run the show, and I think I think I've, that I've done a good job at that. How big a difference was that college? Uh, not really big difference because you know our playbook at Tennessee was kind of hectic for those c- couple years. So, <laughs> yeah. So you know, just just learning new things is not, nothing really. You know that I that I can handle. It's gonna be strange when they get started in a week or so. And- <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I mean it's definitely gonna be strange, but you know I can't wait to see my boys ball. You know. <laughs> Think they're gonna be good? Yeah, for sure. Definitely.